Good morning, Nigeria. Today is October 1st. And coming live from Market Square here in Ekoma, Eastern West local government area of Red Doe State, this is Victor Odi presenting for AAU Online News. And what do we have for discuss today? It is the Independence Day in Nigeria. What is its usefulness? Look around everywhere in this part of the globe. There is no sign of any independence happening here. But the citizens will have their reasons why. So we are going to meet them now to know what is the reason. What do they see about Independence Day in this country? Thank you very much. Join me. EAU Online News. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Um, sir, my name is OJ Gospar from AAU Online News. Uh, sir, please, I would like to know, um, today is uh, Independence Day, the 58th Independence of Nigeria, and I would like to know what's your take on today's independence? What do you, what's your view, what's your point of view? Uh, my point of view that the Nigeria economic is not stable. Okay. So, you see the federal road now, how it is. So, the economic, we in Nigeria, we are suffering. Both children, both mother, both father, we are suffering. Our economy is totally down. So our economy is not, it's not, it's not stable. So we plead our, our federal government to do something concerning about our economy so that we, we can enjoy this uh, the present uh, uh, administration. So secondly, they have to fight for we did have light. They will have to fight for light so that our light will be stable. And secondly, we didn't have road. We will go to federal road and we see the hard road at the, the most from uh, Bijo to Opoji Junction. The road, uh, the road is totally damaged. So the, we plead our uh, federal government to do something about it. That's what I said okay. about it. Thank you very much, sir. I, I really appreciate it. And I would like to know. From, from from the very first time we gained our independence from 1960 up to now, can you can you say that back then and now can you compare it to which one do you think is better? Is it back then or is it right now? Uh, presently now our economic our government is very very bad. It's very 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 bad. Is the before is better than this present time. All right. Okay, sir, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. I'd like to ask one more question and then we'll call it a, a, a close. Uh, what is your advice? What is your advice for this country? What do you advise the Nigerian, uh, the, 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 the citizen of Nigeria? What is your advice for the government and for the citizen? Uh, what are the advice that I give to the government and the citizen? We citizens have to strongly, we have to strongly, so, so that we can meet up. So this present government had to do something we individual. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, sir. We really appreciate. It. Okay. Thank you, sir. Yeah, sir. Today, as it seems, is October 1st, and looking around, many persons are in the mood of an independence celebration. Please, sir, can you throw more light on Nigeria as it is today and what the need for independence really is in Nigeria? Let me correct you. It's not everybody that is in a mode of uh, celebrating. We are celebrating Monday. We are not celebrating independence. Nigeria is not an independent country. So if we are, if you see people celebrating, they are celebrating the first of f f f the first day of the month, not celebrating independence. We don't have independence in this country. But dating back to history, as we were told, we were told that October 1st, 1916, Nigeria gained their independence from the colonial masters. And you say Nigeria is not independent, sir. It's kind of contrasting that history. Sir, please throw more light on it. Okay, if we are saying, well, okay, I'm, let, do I say I'm sorry for saying that Nigeria is not an independent country? But what are we enjoying as a independent country, as an independent country? We are not, we're not enjoying anything. Right now, there's no light in this place, in this whole Ekoma, no light. Okay, how do we not say we are an independent country? How do we say? You can answer that. Or ask those who are who say they are independent country to answer that. We don't have light in this country. There are many things we are suffering. So if we are under colonial masters, we not say we will not we enjoy that. That's what we are enjoying. Not Nigeria saying the independent country. But we are taught in primary schools that uh, in 1960 we got independent, but I don't know how it was how they got their independence. I don't know. The whole you can just look at the whole town and nobody is celebrating, nobody's enjoying. We are only enjoying today's Monday. God has spared our life that we are in today, Monday. We are not celebrating the, uh, 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 independence.
So, sir, are we saying that if there is a move for us to go back to the Colonial Masters as it is now, we are going to gladly accept? Very, very happy. We will be happy. We will be celebrating. In fact, we will we'll be in a joyful mood. It shows that even the indigenous leaders have failed us. And we don't have leaders. We don't have leaders. Just forget about it. We don't have leaders. Okay, sir. So, what is your word of advice to the country, Nigeria? What do you see that should be? What are the measures that you think should be put in place? We just pray that uh, God will send somebody to come and rule this country for us, so that we can now have independence. We can also celebrate first of October every year. Right now, we don't even know. We don't know where we are. We are, we are this is a dark country. We don't have what, what, what. I don't know what is meant by Nigeria. Is Nigeria celebrating independence? I don't know. I don't know. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Yes. Afa. I did Afa. Adeo, what do we do today? Today is independence now. You know, we'll be like independent everywhere. Just How many years Nigeria did today? Nigeria reached 58 today. 58? I think what? it's compared to the president now. So. What do you think say, Nigeria don't achieve at 58? I don't know anything Nigeria don't achieve, but we never really achieve anything. Because me, I'm big economic student, so... Nigeria get plans right from time. We actually get plans as a country, but those plans where we highlight out, we never make any achievement concerning those plans. You think, say, the problem of Nigeria now the government have been at the citizens? Not everybody. Because even we say if we be citizens, individually, if we go there to be government, we will still go lose grab like that. Everybody now just in your own pocket today. So I don't blame the government. I don't blame the citizen. I just blame... The, the problem is not just Nigeria, because next year, now 2020, and we are there aware of division 2020, nothing they solve. We know we not just get any hope of accomplishing that vision. So, well, I thank God to say independence here. Yeah. It's a good thing we are doing independence. We are independent on our own, but we not just see the relevance. As you can see how everywhere is busy now. Nobody is sent whether they do it. I know even when Nigeria I was surprised say you were super eagles. So <laughs> you're a very loyal and patriotic Nigeria. Um can you do something for me? Something like please sing um the first item of Nigeria. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Arise, oh compatriot. <laughs> Why they shout out for all the game? My singer Loki now. Okay. Arise, oh compatriot. Nigeria, call obey to serve our father's land with love and strength and faith. One nation bound, our heroes' past shall never be in vain. To serve with heart and mind. Thank you. <laughs> no, you try. Okay, bye bye. Good morning, sir. Good morning, my brother. Um, sir, please, I would like to ask, from 1960, when Nigeria first gained our independence, up to now, what is that one thing that you can pinpoint that Nigeria has accomplished from 1960 up to 2018? Uh, my brother, you can see, previously, when they were celebrating independence, okay. you can see many people, they will go to field and march, and do some other uh, ceremonies. But now you can see everywhere is scanty. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nobody is moving. Nobody is putting on. Nobody is showing that this is, is from Nigeria. Oh, yeah. It's like we are no longer in Nigeria. You can see everybody is all, uh, moving about his own business. Nobody is care about whether they are doing independent or not. Yes, sir. We, are, we, are, we are surprised. Whether we are practicing democracy or not, we mm. don't know what we are doing now. It's like Nigeria is a state of confusion. We are confused. That's the only thing. Wow. That, 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 that's nice. Um, sir, you said it's like Nigerian is, is, is in a state of confusion. Yes. And that persons are not uh, happy, they are not joyful about today's independence. And I would like to know from you, why do you think so? Why is it that persons in Novo come out to celebrate uh, Nigeria at 58? Why is it like that? Why? Because they are not happy with the situation of the country. It's like the country is interwoven. People who are buying, they are no longer selling. People who are selling now, they are no longer buying. If you can see some of the off here, we are businessmen. For over maybe now, since uh, from now to from since morning now, nobody have ever come to shop us. How much is this? But if it is before, you can see some of uh, some people they will move me around, asking for chicken. Taking their children to go uh, to, uh, out to maybe ask them, what do you care for? We are celebrating independent. You can see nobody is doing such a thing now. Wow. Uh, 
uh, uh, uh, lastly, sir, before 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 we call, call this to a close, uh, I would like to I would like you to advise the country, advise the citizen, advise the, the the leadership of our great country, Nigeria. At least one word, one word for for for, for Nigerian. Thank you. In terms of that leadership aspect of it, it is we that is we poor man they are suffering it. We can no longer reach to them. Neither they will reach to us. Even though we talk from that next year, what they what is in their mind is what they are going to do. We cannot force them to do what is uh, what is not in their mind. So it's like we we don't have it's like we don't have somebody we can represent Nigeria generally. We don't have somebody who can represent Nigeria generally. You can see, okay, go to feed now. Those days, in 96, uh, those days in since um, um, 1970s, downwards or so, or 1980s, you can see by this period now, children will be putting on their uniform. You go to feed, you see the different, different dance. People will be dancing, people will be celebrating, people will be having that kind of that. Today, yes. Today is the day Nigeria gets independent. But that was a skin. We have not seen anything about anything out of it. Thank you very much, sir. I really appreciate Nigerians. They appreciate what you said thus far. Thank you very much. Just say uh, 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 to our viewers, happy independence. Happy independence. Okay, thank, you, thank you, my brother. Thank you. Nigeria likes today. Sir, can you tell us what we are doing today, sir? Uh, we are doing uh, ourselves uh, independent. Can you throw more lights on the self-independence? Because from the views of so many persons, Nigeria is really not free as it seems to be. Well, but depending, every person has own uh, individual opinion about uh, Nigeria. But for me, I think it's moving forward. Uh, it's moving forward. So comparing Nigeria of before 1960 and the Nigeria of after 1960, which would you prefer, sir, in all honesty? I prefer the, pre the present one. Give us reason, sir. Uh, I know in those days, in those days, there was no television, eh? there was no phone where you can, even you have to write. And if you, if you write, you are not sure whether somebody will get it. But now you can sit down at your comfort of your home and they decide to discuss with their people. Uh -huh. So that, that, I see that one as an improvement. But sir, even having, having, uh, having all of these things as our disposal at this jet age, but we are still lacking so many amenities for ourselves. Even the funds to maintain the phone sets and every other thing is not there. So, uh, well, we may not get all at a time. And even like America, we are copying from. They are still having their weak areas. Uh, the only thing that are leaders they should put more effort to see that uh, the country is comfortable for every person. So please wish everyone, all of our viewers, a happy independence. Sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish every person a very happy independence. So you see, that Nigeria will change. It's not only for one person. It depends on you. If you are able to bring up a very fine children in your home with discipline and all those things, you are helping to get a better, better Nigeria. So it's not only for the head of state. Thank, Thank you very much, sir. Uh, Good morning, sir. Good morning. Uh, sir, my name is OJ Gospawa from uh, AU Online News. Uh, sir, I would like to ask you, as in, what will be your take on today's independence? What do you feel like, as in, would they celebrate her? Because I just move and I heard the system things already happen. What will be your take, sir? Um, the first time I'm very entangled and I'm very happy where God created me what is today. Um, 58 years, we thank God, and this uh, our Nigeria we very happy. We have peace, and we are doing business for here. We are happy. Only we will have a small problem we will get now for road. Road now is blocked. Motor they carry our goods, some go stay two days, some go stay three days for rot. Our teeth, you are swelling. And then now only what we beg Nigeria, we know so you, you, you try and you are try. And we we'll see they pray for them. May the God see they give us power. And we are very happy. Now let our problem be that. And we are happy today. I'm very happy and I see they greet our president. You are trying. You are trying, you are trying, you are trying. Uh, uh, 
sir, what you are what you are trying to say now is that as things they happen for this country, so to you, you are happy with what they happen as in everything day, everything day, everything day peaceful to you, everything day in a good state to you. Um in, in for my sides I'm happy today because I reached today the first one and there's so many problems when they happen with the hearer and they will not be happy for that one but we see the free gods may God help us to help this our leaders make this problem and make Nigeria continue with peace because of time, I want to ask you one last question. For 2019 election, when they come up, if you are opportune to vote, which we know say God will give you that opportunity, will, will you vote for Buhari again as our as our next president of this country? Yes, now Buhari I will vote for. Now Buhari I will vote. Okay, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay, good morning, sir. Today is October 1st. Happy New Month, and as people will say, Happy Independence. What do you say about Nigeria? What is the importance of this Independence Day in Nigeria? Well, I'm glad to be a Nigerian. Because in Nigeria, we are free and fair. We have freedom of movement and expression. That is why it's good. When we were with our colonial masters, we have no right to express our feelings. And even to an extent, for us to move to a various destination as i as i am now i have freedom i mean i'm from cross river state but right now i'm in a do state in ekoma so if it was at that uh, at the colonial stage at Iran, when they were colonizing us they were using us as slaves we were not having that freedom to move here and there even in, to even travel out or to even do our business but since we regain our independence since 1960 to today, we have right to do anything. And what the prayer I have for Nigeria is that we should be able to know ourselves and we should conduct a free and fair election and we should make sure we know those people that will lead us where those are the ones with whom we are, we are supposed to vote for. So we shouldn't be hoping on money, but we should make sure we have the right leader that will lead us to engage or to get our satisfaction as a state, as a country, in order for us not to be degraded by all outside countries. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much for such a precise and brief um, explanation on the state of Nigeria. But quickly, you made mention of we are free, there's freedom of everything. But can we say that today there is really freedom in Nigeria? There is freedom in Nigeria. There is freedom in Nigeria. As a Nigerian, we are even happy because we have freedom. There is freedom in Nigeria. If there is no freedom, these vehicles that are passing, and even you as a human, you will not have freedom to come to this place. Even to even entertain me, I don't know what you have in mind. I will feel you want to harm me or something else. So there is a freedom of expression. Thank you very much, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, good morning, Daddy, sir. Oh, daddy, good morning, sir. Uh, God first. Uh. God first. God first. God first. Uh, daddy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know, daddy. and uh, okay. so bad government, eh? Huh? Then make messes on that bridge. If better government day, personal is on that bridge. Nigeria, then they walk back. Oh, so we have to listen. I worry that. They say everyone like government. Everyone like be government too. Head. Huh? If we go, we don't have a job. We have one, we have one. We have one, we have one, we have one. Daddy, I want to ask you one question. You say Nigeria, not bad. Nigeria, everything does scatter, everything maga maga. Nigeria, jaga jaga. I want to ask one question. Will it be the problem of our country? I, I, I don't really know. Uh, our leaders, we will beg them. We will beg our leaders. Make Nigeria better. Uh, not be government, too. not be anything. Too. So, there's everyone that comes. I don't know if we too. So, make Nigeria better. Oh. Oh. 
you, sir. Thank you, sir. Fighting for freedom is good, but fulfilling the purpose is better. At this point, every Nigerian on the street is expressing their mindset on the importance of Independence Day in Nigeria. Is it worth celebrating at all? This is the question that I leave to you, my viewers, to ponder upon. This is still Victor the Spirit Bean on the air reporting for AAU Online News. Thank you very much.